joining us again today I just want to show you the envelope system I don't have it in front of me at all however I have don't judge me okay just don't judge me this is by the way this is a judgment free zone this is just a be you and that's a judgment free so don't judge me okay I recorded an envelope system video years ago because I had planned to do this a long time ago. I had planned to do a channel a long time ago and yeah, it didn't it didn't happen. I wonder. I wonder what's going on with my mind like that, right? So anyway, I recorded it and never posted it. So watch the video of the envelope system and don't judge me. Hi, it's Jay from Jane and Company. I hope you got to watch my last video cutting credit cards, which is one of the hardest things that I ever have to do on this financial journey. Um, but I wanted to share something that it works for me. One of the most important things that works for us here is living with cash and making sure that we budget properly. And one of the things I'm gonna show you is an envelope system. The envelope system that I was using before was literally just envelopes. And what I would literally do is just, I, so you can see, I would type up, um, what I was gonna put in here every paycheck. So it's literally everything I need is ties and kids' birthday parties. I even have like a, a fund um, that I needed to save for for the dentist, so I put that on there. And there's just many more envelopes where that came from. It's kind of never ending, think about it. So what I do is every two weeks when we get paid, I populate my envelopes of the budget that I I'm going to use for that week and the following week so it's every two weeks and what happens is if I go take the money out that week um, to use it and you know the following week I don't have anything well unfortunately I'll be out of funds for that so it actually keeps me on task with the budget and if I run out I run out I have to wait for the next check to populate my envelopes and that's what I, I do. And a lot of people find it very difficult um, to do cash and work as an envelope system. However, for me, it has been much easier, a much easier process because as when I carry my debit card around, it's easy for me to swipe, swipe, swipe. And by the end of the day, um, I'm just swiping away and not knowing what's coming out. So I no longer swipe unless it's for gas. So I use my debit card only for gas and um, that's it. That's it for gas. Um, I even have my work lunch. So anything that I need, um, I populate in here with envelopes. If it runs out before my next check, oh well. That's the way the cookie crumbles, right? So what, I'll, what I'm going to show you is a new system that I created a template for. This envelope system works great. Nothing wrong with it doing this way. Some people use a coupon um, little binder and then put the tabs of what they put their, their category and then put the cash in it. And that's great too. Um, it's also making it easy for people who like to travel with it. I do not like to travel with this load because let's say I have money in my dentist but I carrying my food money and I go out and I overspend on my food I'm gonna hit my dentist cash and I don't like to do that so I only take what I need and I stay within budget and task and I've saved so much um yes I saved so much this way especially because um one of the most things that I've noticed that we spend a lot on is takeout restaurants. Um, so when we first started, we noticed that, that it was a lot of, money, a lot of money that was going into that last year. And ever since we started budgeting this way, all that extra money has been going straight into debt. Um, 
I will um, talk more about it in my vlog and show how much have we saved and um, and later on I'll let you know how much debt we have paid off so far on our journey um, it's a it's it's a very happy exciting experience knowing how much we have paid so far how far we have come and it's not easy it's not easy because there there's bumps in the road along the way and um, even though we have an emergency fund what happens is if something happens one of our car breaks down we have to hit the emergency fund and that's where it goes so at that time that means our debt has to get on put on a hold and we have to restart saving for our emergency fund so that's something important to know and it has happened a few times but gratefully God has always been on our side and we have been able to save very quickly an emergency emergency fund several times and just overly grateful for that so I created this template which I find amazing and does not to toot my own horn or anything like that but, um, just because I realized that sometimes even though that you are budgeting you get into some instances where you're like I'm out in this envelope let me take from another envelope and that happens I get it um, so I needed something more specific I needed something to keep um, kind of like a, a document of okay if I am taking from this time of what am I taking for why do I keep taking money out of it and so I created this template here which is an envelope let's see if you can see it and on here it has the category on top sorry <laughs> I will add it to my blog so you can see as well so it has the category on top it has the budget here so for example I will give you this is our lunch um, for work budget and it's a very low budget because when we cook dinner we make sure that we have leftovers for lunch the next day so for two weeks our lunch budget is 120 so it's $120 so I'll put lunch for work $120 for the budget and then every time I take money from here I'll put the date what I took it for the amount excuse me the amount that I took and what is left and so this is gonna be great as I do need to keep tabs on it I need to make sure also make sure that you know if I'm taking too much out of it do I need to increase the budget in this envelope so it worked really great um, I do have a miscellaneous envelope and the miscellaneous envelope would be amazing because it's miscellaneous what am I taking out every time that I'm on there so just um, what I'm going to show you real quick is simply just how to turn it into an envelope um, just in case because sometimes you know literally I'm just going to cut around the lines so you can see I mean, sometimes this works for a lot of people. Definitely worked for, for us. It was something that was a little difficult at first to get started. And it took about, I'm gonna say a good three months to get the hang of it and figure out, okay, this is what I'm taking out this check. Um, because it also has to align with your bills. And you have to make sure that you are budgeting it correctly. When you you can visit my site and sign up to get this free template and along with this free template you will get another form and the form is gonna look just like this and it says envelope system on top it says envelope categories amount and notes and basically what this is is just to keep tabs on what envelopes you are using, the amounts, and then everything you needed are right there. Um, so sometimes I can't afford to take out all my envelopes in one check. Um, so I have to, like, you know, just like rearrange, rearrange stuff depending on what 
when your bills come out or anything like that. I work very well with writing stuff. Um, I am tech savvy, but I need something like physical and I need to write and this looks works great for me. I love it very much. Um, I originally just kept it on a notepad, but um, now, you know, I created this form as well as the envelopes and I will going to keep it um, kind of like a budget binder and that's something that I will also talk to you about later just so you guys can get an idea. Um, so this works really well. So I cut it out. And basically you just fold across all the lines. And many of you may think that this is very um, tedious and oh, I don't need to do any of that stuff. I can keep track. So, you know, by all means, you know, everyone does things differently. This is something um, my husband and I really needed to do as we never really kept track of our expenses. Um, I always kept track of the bills, but not the expenses. And this is something that it just helps us budget. So I'm going to glue the edges here bolt everything down. So I'm going to glue the edges and then I'm going to lift this over. Okay. So you see that's in the front. I'm just going to fold this over here. And this is the only thing you need to glue or tape, staple, whatever is your preference. And then it's all set. And the money should fit just perfectly fine, so I'll give you an example. It's in there. See that? And then the next step to do is just write what category you're going to use this for and what's going to be your budget every two weeks or whenever you get paid because everyone gets paid very differently. I get paid bi monthly, people get paid weekly. So it's more of a preference for you when you want to fill up your envelopes. Um, so I, I've done different things this past year. I did every two weeks. Recently, what worked better for me because of the way my bills come out is, excuse me, is to fill them every month. Um, so I just fill them once a month and if I run out early, I'm in big trouble. Um, so yeah, so this is the envelope system. I highly, highly, highly recommend living with cash because I'm gonna tell you what because I live with with cash I spend less I don't use my debit card and if I need my lunch food I don't really want to give out the cash so I spend so much less we paid so much debt off because of it and I just thought everyone if you have any questions feel free to visit my site um, the link will be in the bottom in the description and I'll have more information in the blog so thank you for joining me today in in the envelope system process um, if you got to watch my last video I apologize it sounds like I'm whispering my daughter was in the room sleeping uh, my baby girl and yeah just keep keep posted and I will keep showing you know what's helping me so I can help you guys Thanks again.